my dear viewers and subscribers welcome to the youtube channel today i shall discuss about construction of a power transformer indicating its various parts their functions and utilities please keep your patience during watching it is not possible to short the video about such a great subject like transformer but try to describe about in an arsel please don't skip watch flies it is the picture of a transformer tank accessories are kept inside the tank and a few accessories are connected outside with the tank it is called main tank some tanks are connected with this tank it is core it is made of thin laminations of silicon steel of thickness 0.33 to 0.5 mm through imbricated joint the core creates path of flow of flux for the windings why the core is laminated the core is laminated in order to reduce the eddy current loss as the loss is directly proportional to the thickness of the core the laminated core are insulated with each other these are windings hv winding is wrapped over the lv winding lv winding being low voltage have less likelihood of occurrence of fault and requires less insulation is thus kept nearer to the core hv windings in the case of step of transformer when connected with ac supply source creates flux that links with lv windings through core lv side windings are connected with load connection leads of the windings are brought outside by suitable bushing the hv bushing the lv bushing bushings are erected on cylindrical post is called turret within turret bushing cities thermal cities are placed a neutral bushing is also placed where it is applicable this is conservator tank it is connected with main tank through pipelines and a relay called bukhoj relay transformer well of main tank reaches at conservator tank and become stored here this is bukhoj relay when in spin fault occurs at windings or code to windings electric flash over is occurred inside oil creates oil vaporization and the vapor comes out and reaches at the bukhoj chamber and become trapped at here sufficient gas accumulation tilt one of the float of bukhoj relay that initiates alarm and then tilt second float to issue a trip of both side circuit breakers of the transformer when accumulation of gas is more besides severe fault when occurred suddenly some oil and gas rushes to the relay and operation of the relay is performed when load of transformer increases transformer oil is become more heated and is expanded in volume the expanded oil reaches at conservator tank when load of transformer diminished or ambient temperature become cool contraction of volume of transformer oil is occurred and oil level of conservator tank goes down this is mog or molg magnetic oil level gauge this is required to know the volume of oil at the conservator tank that is main tank sufficient oil should be kept in conservator tank that is inside the main tank so that core and winding should not be exposed being shortage of transformer oil 
MOG indicates level of oil inside the transformer tank, the conservator tank during normal operation is remain one third filled at 30 degree centigrade. During expansion of oil, air inside conservator tank is released through the breather and similarly during contraction of oil, air enter into the conservator through breather. This is like breathing process of living world and that is why it is termed as breather. Breather is a small pot where silica gel of blue color is kept to absorb moisture during entrance of air. When the gel become pink colored, it should be replaced by new. These are inlet and outlet valve. It is OLTC on load tap changer and DS and TC diverter switch and tap changer. It works to control voltage of load side to a desirable value by changing tap at AG side here without shutting down load or switching off the transformer. This is OSR and conservator tank mean for OLTC. OSR means oil surge relay. This relay acts at the production of heat due to fault inside the tap changer and subsequent production of huge gas inside oil and it issues mandatory shutdown of transformer by tripping both side circuit breakers. This is PRD or PRV, pressure release device or pressure release valve, heated oil and gas released from the tank through the device when suddenly heavy fault occurred inside the transformer. It acts like a pressure cooker release valve. These are cooling system consist of radiator bank, cooling fans, cooling motors. During voltage conversion, various losses of energy is occurred. Some portion of it is converted into heat. Heat is brought out from core and windings to avoid damage of the same through transformer oil. The tank and radiator are kept filled with transformer oil. Hot oil is drawn by cooling motors to the radiator fins where the hot oil radiate heat to the air outside by fanning action. Normally, heat is radiated in the air surrounding by radiator only when the load is few. Fan and motor increase the rate of cooling. Every power transformer is incorporated with winding temperature indicator and oil temperature indicator WTI and OTI. Sensor bulb of the indicator is kept at the pocket where hot oil circulation is going on and near the winding. Expansion and contraction of oil or vapor inside the sensor bulb according to the temperature of the oil or winding is taken to calibration equipment to operate WTI, OTI and issue tripping of circuit breaker when temperature reaches beyond preset value. Lastly, the whole system is filled with transformer oil to give additional insulation and to protect the transformer from overheating and fault. Many videos subjecting various parts of transformer have already been uploaded. You may watch the videos at this channel. Thank you.